Welcome back guys. We're going to be working on Biggles Wade again. And this is going to be seriously tricky. Now, the consensus on the last video was that you guys wanted me to do this like all in one. Um, the whole line up through Chudley and whatever. But actually, um, I've, run into some, I've run into some issues. And well, you know what? You'll see. You'll see. Let me, let me, let me do this. Right. First thing we need to do is, is create some space. We've got, we've got major problems with like terrain differences and stuff. Uh, it, this is not going to be easy. In fact, I would go so far as to say it's going to be freaking hard to, to make this work. And, and the other thing is I've got to like kind of destroy Chudley. Ch not Chudley, Biggles Wade. Um, I've got to like, pretty much destroy Biggles Wade because I've got to sort this terrain out and stuff. Like, like so somehow we've got, we need like a tunnel going under here or something. Um, uh, I mean, over here, I, well, I don't know what the hell I'm going to do over here. Um, but yeah, this is going to be serious and freaking difficult. No idea how I'm going to do it. Right, let's knock some more of the city down, because obviously we haven't knocked anywhere near enough of it down yet. <laughs> got, to, got to do a full-on Godzilla on the place. Right, so let's see. How on earth are we going to do this? Well, I'm thinking that... I'm hoping that this level over here is, is good enough. Let, let's find out. Let's find out. So we want, um, definitely want a four-lane road going through here, I think. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to try and run it up to there, which is kind of like just before where I want it to make a tunnel. So let's put that in. Now, here, we do actually want to be going up, but we don't want to be going up that much. So now I need to decide like, what exactly is going to be my terrain level on this side. Now, obviously, we would love to um, to have this as our level, but I don't think that's going to work. Because if we like, if if we run a road like just like straight up there, actually, that's not that's not too bad going up there. Okay, what I wanted to, what I wanted to do, um, and I can't do it on this side because of this. But what I wanted to do was a, was a, a really cool like semicircle on this side, and, and then have all my um, commercial in the center clustered around the the station. That would have been really cool, but I just don't think we can do it. So if I uh, God, let's put in a straight bit. God, if I can, if I can actually get a straight bit. Please, please, developers. Put in something to allow you to get straight freaking roads. Okay, so now, like, if we bring this down here, now that is quite a terrain difference. <laughs> yeah, like, that's a hell of a terrain difference. That's like if he dropped you down. Okay, so it's not that f it's not that far down. Okay, I I think we can I think we could probably do something. Okay, that's pretty much as straight as we're gonna get. Because what I want is a nice I want a nice kind of sharp angle on here. That's why I didn't want to play around with the terrain on here. So if we pop that in. The, I mean, the only problem with this is that we're probably going to get stupid buildings trying to build along here. Which is, um, yeah, that's potentially a problem. But, I mean, that's something I'm just going to have to figure out. But you can see, this not easy. Not easy. And then over here, I kind of want to do the same thing. Oh, man. But, of course, this, because this doesn't come out straight, this won't come out straight. <laughs> Let's put that in like that. Can I get a straightish road coming down here? And the answer is, I can kind of sort of. I think that is relatively straightish. My God. Then we can put that six lane road back in. Where's uh, six lane? Here we go. Extra large street. So that's going to hook up to there. All right, cool. So now I've got to hook these up. Okay, so before we had this road coming in here. 
and uh, having this bridge bending around here and, and going over here, which is, if you think about it, like kind of nonsensical because really we want this road going into the center. But I suppose we want it going this side as well to connect up to this main road, which is going to go um, to Ashby. Does it go to Ashby at the moment? I suppose actually, like we've got this, if I rework this a bit so that we have this road going up here um, and have this road going all the way to Ashby, we're going to have the rail link from here uh, going up to Ashby as well. So, yeah, actually, I suppose we want this this road hooking up to both, but I don't like the fact that this is curving across here and I don't like the fact that it's like so bowed. So, let's sort this out. Get rid of you, get rid of you, and you. Okay, at this point, I'm gonna jump to the time lapse because the next 30 minutes, We'll spend putting in one bridge, <laughs> yeah, which is um, which is a little bit crazy, but I, I don't know. It, it's something that I'm running into now with with this whole build uh, of Biggleswade, and that is I want things to be perfect, and whereas before I might kind of go, ah, you know, that'll do. I'm kind of much, much less inclined to do that. So, like with this bridge, I wanted the bridge, the bridge pillars to be equally spaced, right? I wanted the bridge to be nice and flat and the pillars to be evenly spaced. Now you wouldn't think really that that was too much to ask. Uh, kinda was, uh, and man, I kinda agonized with this and and yeah, I ended up spending 30 minutes putting in one bridge. Now, when you see the end result, I don't know, some of you I'm sure will turn around and go, you know what, that was 30 minutes well spent because that's a really nice looking bridge. Some of you will look at it and go, like really, why on earth would you spend 30 minutes when you could probably have got like, I don't know, like you, like, you could have just put a bridge in. like. Why did it have to have like the pillars exactly, you know, exactly equally spaced and perfect? Um, but that's the thing, you know, and and this kind of extends to the whole map. But like it, it's it's kind of being brought into focus by Biggleswade, and it's that thing about like what's good enough, you know, like how much time do I spend trying to get things absolutely freaking perfect? And this carried on for like the next um, hour or so after after I'd done the bridge. And um, I'm actually gonna go and work on that section of the video now because I'm gonna have to trim the video back. The problem is like, I'm, I'm talking through the process uh, and and kind of illustrating where uh, where I've got issues and where I've got frustrations and, 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 and stuff like that. And it's kind of difficult to know like what to cut out and what to leave in to make them the, the most number of people happy. Anyway, I'm, I'm pretty much done, so let's get back to it. I've got oh, so many types of bridges now. That's, that is, I've got to say, that is a pretty nice bridge. Look at the, uh, what is it, Colin Brook? Cole Brown Cole Brook. Yeah, but no, I think, we, I think we're just gonna go, uh, not that one. I think we're just going to go with one of these. Now that is great spacing. Why did it take me half an hour to do it? That's the blooming issue. Right, boom, in it goes. And then we'll just get rid of uh, those two sections. In fact, we're going to get rid of that section as well. And then just run that into the That does drop down a little bit in the middle, doesn't it? Which, like if you were actually an, a, a civil engineer, you you would say, you would, you would smooth that out. So we're gonna smooth that out a little bit. The, the problem is that sloping down is gonna kind of force it to slope down. Um, so I actually probably need to take it back a bit further. Let's try. That's, that raises it up a little bit. Let's 
take it back another section. And, and that is much better. That is much, much better. You can see how it's adding to the terrain, so. Oh, that's so much better. This actually looks a little bit on the steep side now, but no, no, I'm not. I'm not going to, I'm gonna leave that in. That's fine. Alrighty, well, we got we got that road done. Only took half an hour, but we got that road done. So, God, I've exhausted having done that. What have I got to do uh, with this road? So, like I said, we want it to go both ways. We want it to go that way, and we want it to go that way. And I'm looking at it now and thinking, can I can I kind of do something nice with this? Um, see, this road has to come up here. Well, I do, actually, it doesn't have to go, go up there. It could kind of go like round there or something, which is probably a better idea. Um, I've got to hook up with this road. Now, this road is coming down here kind of, kind of, sort of okay-ish. But it's then got, that's a, a fair old terrain drop to get that to hook up to this. Uh, I don't want large country road. I want a uh, large street. So, like, like if I was to just, well, I mean, pop, well, it actually will do it. But look how freaking steep that is. It's crazy, crazy steep. Now, I, some of you were leaving comments saying, oh yeah, but there are steep roads in, in, in towns and whatever. Yeah, but you think that looks good? Because I don't think that looks good. Like not, not particularly good anyway. I mean, oh, that, that's just, I mean, that's that's streets of San Francisco, which is just a bit too much for me. So. The, the problem is that uh, like houses and whatever and, build, and, and commercial buildings are gonna build on these streets and then it's gonna look absolutely freaking awful. So I think maybe we just rip this out and just relay it. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna bring the terrain down a bit. Because it's it's just too damn much. Uh, let's just get rid of all of this. Goodbye, goodbye. See, we've got this road coming in. Now, if, if this is the road that's gonna hook up to this, which I, I'm guessing it probably is, um, So we, we want that to go out kind of like that. That's a bit more reasonable. But I'd still like this to come down a little bit more. So let's take and let's have you coming down. Now, if I take you down a notch, ooh, that's, I wish you could control this a little bit more than you can. But I think, th I think that's the kind of thing, it needs to come down that far. And then, see from there, then we should get like a relatively, oh God, we should get a relatively shallow drop down to here. So that's way, way, way better, way better. Right, I'm gonna go with that. Which road did I use? Yeah, I used the fast one, good. Okay, so now I'm quite happy for this to stay like relatively steep up here. I don't wanna, I don't wanna like get rid of this or anything. Um, and I'm quite happy for the, for the houses to kind of sink into the cliffs and whatever. I'm not, I'm not upset about that. It's just, the, the problem is road junctions. Because it does, the game just does like some fairly horror, horrific things with road junctions when the road gradient is too steep. That's the problem. 
Um, this is going to have to freaking go and be relayed, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to have to go. It's going to have to go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Um, boom. Boom, 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 boom. All of it. Go away. All right, cool. So, um, what's our height difference here? That's the big question, I guess. Let's have a look. Not, actually not that bad. Actually not that bad. Let's just use that too. Because it's just this big lump in the terrain here. And actually that's not too bad. All right, well let's, let's just smooth that down and see how it looks once, once it's had a, a bit of a smooth. Uh, this is gonna need a bit of lowering on this side. But actually, not as much as I thought. Not as much as I thought at all. All right, that I can, you know what? That I can live with, that I can live with. All right, let's, um, Let's just drop that down a bit. A uh, little bit there, a uh, little bit there, a uh, little bit there. Okay. Right, now let's smooth that off. And then I think we're actually going to have something that I can live with. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, like, it's still pretty up and down, but I think that I can at least live with. All right, cool. So, um, we've got the road going out of town on that side. We've got the road which goes out that way, so that's fine. So all we've got to do is hook this up. So I think we actually want to go back a tiny bit, probably to, like, at least there. And then we've got to get this road to fork which is sometimes easier said than done, or at least getting it to fork in a nice way. So like if we have that like that, and I've got, I've used the wrong freaking one. Uh, oh no, I'm switching to a street from a, so like what I want is for that to just give me a nice, a nice Y fork, but, but of course it won't. Okay, so that's like kind of okay now. This side is bearable. That side, I mean, can I live with it? I, well, I suppose so. It, I don't like it, but I guess I'll, I guess I'll live with it, kind of, sort of. But look how steep it is to get down here. It's gonna be problematic. Uh, let's take you back to there, where I think you're still sloping. Now, if we, oh, like, really? Just, oh, God damn it. <laughs> ah! Right, that's what I wanted. Now, how freaking steep is it? Okay. Like, that actually is not too bad. We can probably live with that. So, let's just, now, you, yeah, you go, still going over that tunnel, so that's fine. Um, this is still kind of crappy, but let's put you in for the time being. All right, cool. And then we want similar thing on this side. Let's have this right up straight. I'm going to hook this up. So I'm going to get rid of this road and hook this up across into there. So it's a straight run up into the 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 depot. Um, yeah, how's that? Yeah, it's just a little bit smoother, a little bit nicer. I've used the wrong type of road, but that's okay. Let's go here. You and large street. I've got to say, for in town, I do prefer this one than, than this one. Let's just have a quick butchers at what they look like. So. Um, so you've got that one with these trees and the these kind of not particularly pretty lampposts. Or this one, which I think is I think the trees are nicer. I think the lampposts are nicer. I like this 
hexagonal paving. Yeah, I, I, for, for like town center type area, I definitely prefer this. Definitely. All right, well, it's what it is. Um, okay, so what the hell was I doing? Uh, I was turning that off and I was trying to get this to come down here. Now, this is gonna be the issue. Like, how, how do we want this to kind of curve into here? Um, like, I don't want it to come in that close, I don't think. But having done it, I'm looking at it and thinking, yeah, actually, it's not that bad. But we've got that road coming out there. So, no, we want this to be coming out, like, much further across, don't we? Um, this road, now, that's a really good point. What the hell am I going to do with this road? Um, do, I just, do I just hook it up to here? The thing is, we've got the trams and whatever. Um, I think, I think actually, we do hook it. Just like, just hook it round here. Yeah. All right. So let's just get rid of this because because we haven't demolished enough of the town yet. <laughs> we need to demolish more. And then hook up like that. And that is like kind of sort of reasonable. That slope. It's a um, lot better than it was. Yeah, it's just it's just kind of taking the, the harshness off this hill, which is definitely better. Definitely better. All right. Now, I I don't know what you guys think, but I think that since this is Biggleswade, and let's face it, Biggleswade seems to be our favorite place, that I want to take my time on, like rather than kind of rushing it, I'd like to actually take my time on this. Um, and I really want to get transport hubs. And I want like, I want my freaking bridges to look absolutely perfect. Um, I do have to remove all of these bits of track on it. So, so yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna rush this. I'm gonna take my time and, and try and get Biggleswade to look not just to, not just to look as good as possible, but to function as well as possible. That is a, that is a nice freaking bridge. I need to decorate that. Right, <laughs> we'll get back to that. Okay, so we've got okay, so we've got the, the the main traffic flow coming in here. We've got it splitting. Um, if you were a town planner, you would say, well, we don't want people to have to go like right through the middle of the town, especially like right next to the freaking station. Um, we want people to be able to go like around there. So I think we need some kind of ring road type scenario going on. So, so like, like this road that comes down into here, like do we actually want like, like a bigger road that comes maybe off the side and comes through here. Like, should this actually be six lane? And that's that's a very, very good freaking question. Because it's, it's six lane out here, and then we've got this four lane section that goes across here. But it could be six. It could be six lane. There's, a, there's an argument, there's an argument for six lane. And then we could have like a, a six lane that goes around and then a four lane that comes in here. I kind of like that idea, guys. I kind of like that idea. And then that, that kind of defines it as like the main road. I mean, I mean, not to say that it's got to be six all the way through, but I got to say, I'm, I don't know, I'm kind of tempted, kind of tempted. And then we want to run this out here and then have a road going down. I think, I let, let, should we do it? Should we do it? Should we make it six? Let's make it six. Let's make it six. So what the hell do I want? I want to upgrade to, um, we're gonna be doing this with extra large country road out here. Now, can I, yes I can. <laughs> so, boom, in you go. And my nice, oh, my nice new bridge won't. You won't. You will. It's just, it's this section here that won't. So if I 
I get rid of that, then hopefully, yeah, then it will. So boom and boom. Now I could just I could just have this six lane into here, but I think like I don't know. Do I do I want to run it six lane through the through the centre of the city? I I got a feeling I kind of do. This is Biggles Wade. Go Biggle, go home, Biggles Wade. So let's let's freaking do it. So let's have six lane going down there, and then we'll have six lane running out here as well. So let's get rid. Oh, uh, actually, did I want to do that? I'm not. It was, I'm just thinking that that would kind of, well, mind you, it's, it's pretty level anyway. I was just thinking of hooking up to kind of the level and whatever, but I think, no, I think we get rid of Get rid of that, we'll put this in and then we'll hook the other one up. So. So yeah, let's run you through. Is that straight? Yeah, that's straight. Let's run you through straight to there. And then we'll run you up here. Uh, this is a, uh, the annoying thing of like getting this to hook on in like in any kind of nice way, and it just won't. Um, and and because this is going to be relatively steep up here, it's going to create a really nasty junction. Um, let's take that out for now. Let's try this again. So let's take you back to where you were flat and then run you out and connect you up to there. Yeah, getting this to hook up and look anything other than horrible <laughs> is going to be a real challenge. What do I want? I want a, whoops, didn't want that. I wanted a street. I want a large street. And I, look what it does to the, I mean, it's just freaking awful. What you have to do is kind of put it in and then take out the old and relay it. Um, uh, but now I need six lane again. Come on, six lane. Thank you. Go away. Oh, God, just come out straight, damn it. I come out straight. Thank you. It's slightly better, but it's still pretty horrible and then do the same on the bottom section as well to try and get it to do something nice. But it, it, it oh God, but it generally won't do nice things. I mean, look at, look at that. And when you put in so much time into trying to make it look nice, if I like, lift it up slightly, that looks like a tiny bit better, but like not a whole hell of a lot. Let's get you, Smooth it off so we can see what the hell this looks like. How, how nice or horrible. That's going to be okay. That's going to be all right, I think. Okay, cool. So then we want full lane of this, which should be, um, should be that one. It, this is all going to get overwritten anyway, so I, I won't kind of stress too much about it. I, well, I think what I'm going to do is bring that through dead straight then clip that back and then how do i how do i hook this up now i could just hook it up oh god i could just hook this up like that god don't you just wish it would do freaking nice things all i want is for that to come out right like straight right and then just do a nice right angle on this end and it there's no freaking way it will so if I just run you around like that see that's all I wanted you to do the problem is because I've done it in two sections it's horrible 
<laughs> you you do need some freaking patience with this game sometimes. Like, like I don't want you to do that. I want you to come in freaking straight. And there's no, there's no freaking option to to say do it this way or do it that way. Like, oh, I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. There's no, there's no way to kind of force it to do what you freaking want it to do. Um, I gotta say, this is a little bit narrow here, but I don't really have that much option. I mean, I suppose that I could, I could move this over slightly to give me a slightly bigger gap there, which I think would actually be a good thing. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Move your back. Let's run this a little bit tighter. But but like not much. Yeah, only like a little bit. Uh, what do I want? I want six lane. So instead of there, we just want you kind of like maybe there. So six lane. So I'm just kind of adding the width of the street. It should just mean I should get some nicer, nicer buildings. Um, yeah, let's do like that. So, oh man, come on. So you're gonna come out just straight up there like that. That's fine. And then we probably want to push that back a couple more sections. And have you run? Thank you. Up like that. There we go. Oh, but look, look what it's doing here. I freaking hate you. Stop screwing up my freaking roads all the time. <laughs> it's annoying. Come on, it is. Uh, right, what, what do I want? So, like I said, it doesn't, it doesn't matter what streets I use because they'll get overwritten. Or I'll go around and update them. Okay, so that comes around and does that. And then we've got the same issue here, but now it's more of a 90 degree. It might actually do something a bit nicer. I mean, it probably won't now that I've said that, but. Oh, man. Like, ah. if, if, I, if, if I could punch this game in the face right now, I would. I absolutely would. I don't want you to do that. I want you to come in straight like a normal freaking road would. Okay. Is that gonna is that gonna do something half decent? I don't know. Let's let's see. Ah, oh, it's bearable. It's bearable. I'll live with it. I will live with that. All right. So need a bit of smoothing is going to be required around the place. But I mean, to be honest, the buildings will kind of to a degree knock down these areas and whatever. Um, But that's, I gotta say, that's way better going out that way than it was. All right, cool. So we've got our main route going through there. That's okay, I'm happy with that. We just need to hook this road up. So let's get you, um, we want, now what do we want here? We've opened it up into a, all lane that way. Yeah, if we do like if we do the same thing with an electric tram track, how does that? That's not. It's not horrific. I'm just wondering, do I want that to be like a slightly tight turn? I, and I'm thinking probably I do. So we run you out to there, and then hook you on. Maybe like that. Yeah, cool. Now, unfortunately, the game is probably going to try and hook this up. Um, which I, I really kind of don't want it to do, but I don't know. We'll just have to. We'll just have to see about that. Now, uh, am I going to do any flattening? I'm going to do a little bit of flattening here. This part, I really don't know. I mean, we, we will get buildings on here. I think what I'm going to have to do is try and encourage it to grow some buildings here 
to, and the buildings will actually act as a barrier to stop it building roads. So I might have to put some, some barriers or something to stop it building roads through here until we get some buildings built and then it'll be fine. All right, so I said I was gonna take out this road, didn't I? Yeah, I said I was gonna take out that road and then I was gonna hook this puppy up with, like I said, it doesn't matter about these streets particularly. Um, gonna hook that up directly to there. I am so tempted to, yeah, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna move this one to get a, to get a nicer connection. So, yeah, that's the, that's the kind of connection that I want through there. Ah, come on. Just come out straight, thank you. See, that, like, that is exactly what I want, but it won't build it. Why not? Why won't you freaking build it, for heaven's sake? Construction not possible. Why? Why is construction not freaking possible? Oh, because there's a freaking little road up there or something. That's in the goddamn way. All right, you know what? <sighs> bring it out straight to there. Or straight. Well, yeah, just bring it out straight to there and then just bring it straight. Oh, what? Like, why? Why won't you just... Why won't it do that? This is... Use the same type of road. Oh, because I've got I'm putting in blooming electric train tracks around the place. <laughs> Idiot. Uh, let's, let's take out the electric train tracks, shall we? Yes. There we go. So, will, uh, so, so does that mean you'll go in now? Now that I'm not using the train tracks, I don't think so. Like, sir, like what the hell? I think it was because there was, I don't know, some freaking connection here. You just put it, you just put it a few roads in, right? How could it possibly be this hard? Like, like what the hell's wrong with that? It, it does make you despair sometimes. Okay, well, it won't put it in straight. Uh, we've got no freaking idea why it won't just put a road in straight like that. Okay, so if I come out at an angle, yeah, then you'll do it. That's crazy. Freaking ridiculous. Um, boom. There we go. All right, so I think we've, we've, we've got our basic road system uh, on that side. On this side, I think we want like a ring road which is kind of sort of what we had before, but I think we want something that's a bit more defined. And then I think we, I don't know, do we, I think we want the same kind of thing on this side. So this road, rather than coming out straight, I think that wants to hook up to this. And then, so that the traffic coming in along here would go this, well, it could go into the center or it could go this way if it was going up to Chudley and actually bypass the, the center. That makes sense to me. So that's what we're gonna do. So let's have, uh, yeah, on straight. So you're gonna come, ugh, but again, it won't, it won't do nice things. I, like, I want this to just like come fricking straight down here. The, like the only way you can really get it to do it is to actually take that out And get the damn thing to come down here, but it's actually curving a bit too much. There, so we want to run you down. Oh, go away. D by the way, don't worry about all the tram tracks and, and all that kind of stuff. I'm going to sort that out later. Um, yeah, I am thinking to bring it around that way. Yeah, that's that's how I want it. That's exactly how I want it. Boom, in you go. All right, cool. Because that like, kind of sort of mirrors the rail tracks a little bit. A little bit, not 100%, but a little bit. Um, okay, so that going around there, that's fine. So people come in that way. So now we want to do the ring road going around this way. So we get rid of that. And then I think, I think it's this 
part where we actually want to divert down to here. And I think we join up there. So let's get rid. Let's get rid of that. And we'll get rid of this. Yeah. So we want this to come off here. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that's not, not particularly flat either. So if we just say, come out this way, come out flat to start off with. And then, but do we, like, do we want that to just come straight across there? I don't think we do. I think we want this to, to curve around a little bit more. Again, to kind of sort of mirror the, the, the railway tracks. So if we just bring you out more like that initially, then have your curve around like that. And obviously the, the issue is the terrain height. So either this needs to come down a little bit faster, which I'm thinking it probably does. Yeah, okay, let's try. Instead of, because I think I brought that out pretty flat, didn't I? Did I bring it out actually flat? There we go. So let's just take it down a notch. So at least we're starting the process. Then bring it round. That's a lot better. A lot better than it was. Yeah, go on. We'll do it. We'll do it. All right. So then some nice smoothing. And we have got ourselves almost a road system. All we've got to do is hook this up to here, and we are we are golden. Um, now again, I could have made like I could have made this side um, six lane, but I don't, I don't know. Don't know. Yeah, I don't. Th I don't think. I don't think we do. I think we have six lane on that side, but I don't think we have six lane on this side. So how the hell do we hook this up? Now, do we I, do we hook this up to this junction like that? I I've got to say, I hate how that looks because there is no way you would have a road junction like that in real life. You just wouldn't. You'd have to have some kind of complicated on ramps and off ramps and roundabouts and all kinds of nonsense going on. So I think maybe we just kind of hook it up to here. But the problem is because this is relatively steep, it's gonna give us something fairly nasty in terms of the ramps and stuff. Um, I mean, I think if we can't bring it down too far because then it, it just kind of looks ridiculous. That is probably about as smooth as I'm gonna get so let's let's pop that in. I want to ask you guys, like, how do you want me to do this? Do you want like episodes like this while we're doing Biggles Wave, where where we're a bit more up close and personal and spending more time on it, or or do you want to time lapse it like we've done before and just kind of blitz through it? I've got to say, my personal preference is to take my time on Biggles Wade. Um, I like working out things like how should the traffic flow through the city, and then like setting up the transport hubs. So how are the tra like where are the trams going to start from and, and how are they going to run around the city and how are they going to hook up with bus lines and how's that going to hook up to the railway station and whatever that's what I'm kind of looking to to do in the next episode now that we've basically got the 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 road network laid out um, and even this I'm looking at and thinking like now I want to relay that <laughs> I, in fact I'm going to I just can't I just can't live with that I freaking hate the way this has I. Come on, it is horrible, isn't it? It's just doing absolutely freaking awful things. I want this to come up here like this. And then I just want you to hook into that. Like, I mean, it's is it too much to ask? Is it too much to ask? I think it's maybe just too much to ask. It's too much to ask for it to do something that's even remotely freaking pleasant. So, I don't know. Let's just freaking hook it up down there, which is how I had it. And just hook you up into there. And just freaking remember the result. Yeah. 
that's that's a little bit steep. I might play around with that. Anyway, <laughs> let's leave it there for this. I don't know. I guess it was kind of a semi-grumpy episode. Um, but I don't know. I, like, I, I complain a lot, but like, I think it's just like most of the time it's just for something to say. Although some of it, I mean, some of it is frustrating. It, it is frustrating. But do I love it? Yes, I still love it. So don't, don't, don't take me too seriously. All right, we'll leave it there. I will catch you for the next episode. Let me know how you would like these episodes to unfold. And I will catch you for the next one. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.